I'll get some uh, foul things stuck in my fur. Ah, good morning, friends. Brandar has returned. I still have a uh, a flute and a drum to my name, good but morning. no way to play them. So Trinkets, I'll see if young Jesse would like to buy them. Yes, I also found some trinkets and odds and ends. Perhaps you are interested in some of them, hmm? Oh, that's right. I can't, uh, mm -hmm. get rid of them. They were actually stolen, so I'll need to just drop them. Get rid of the evidence! There. Tell Sven that he can have this junk if he wants. Goodbye! Probably shouldn't show my face in Riverwood again. Hmm. I do regret what happened to Feindel, but, uh, these people should know. Camilla is mine, and only mine. She doesn't know it quite yet, but she will. Don't you worry. Brandar's got this one covered. Sabotage Sven? Do what I must with Feindel? He's a, he's a Danmar, he didn't like this place anyways. Or is he, is he a Bosmer? He's a Mur of some kind, you know? Oh, I missed. I was hoping I wouldn't miss, but I seem to have missed. Ah, we'll try to enjoy the day as best we could. The Dark Brotherhood did not visit me in the night, as uh, I've heard that they might if you take an innocent life. So perhaps Mr. Feindal was not as innocent as we like to think, hmm? Or perhaps he did deserve the fate that befell him. Yes, of course. These are both uh, valid things to think. And I think I can see Whiterun just over the way. Oh my. It's a giant city, isn't it? Wow. The Jarl lives in this house, I presume? Interesting. Brandar should like to have a look inside. And uh, I don't know if I'll be back to to Riverwood anytime soon. Hmm. Should stay away until things cool off just a little bit. Can I make it across this river? It seems not. There's a bridge just that way. Ah, beehives outside the meadery. Hmm. Makes me want to have a taste of their special brew. I could like that a lot. Is this the right way? No, of course it isn't. Brandar, silly, silly kitty. Chase the butterflies. Yes. All's, all's gone well. This is uh, quite a wonderful morning. And I thought that I heard uh, a little something down here. Maybe it was on the other side. Hmm. It's a familiar sound. Yes, yes indeed. A troll under the bridge? No, it's just me. And a Nern root. Yes, Nern root. <clears throat> if I should ever return to Cyrodiil, perhaps uh, I should look into the adventurer's brew although the Imperials did take most of uh, my goods that includes the Nern root that I had been saving ah but alas we shall find some more I suppose it doesn't matter so much Ooh, chopping the woods yes they're having quite a wonderful time around here if only I could figure out how to get into the town, I might uh, be in luck. Up, oh. up, oh. up, oh. over the water. All right, that's how we do it. Hmm. 
This is interesting. I shouldn't like shouldn't like to enter through the sewers. No, indeed. I'll get some uh, foul things stuck in my fur if I head down that way. Ah, and it's a good thing we didn't, because the entrance is just here. Hmm. Now where to find this Jarl? Curious, curious. I should like to pick some plants. That's quite a nice thing. Hold. Hmm. So close with the dragons about. Official business oh. only. Well, my friend, uh, I have news from Helgen Fine. about the dragon attack. I'll be keeping an eye on you. No need, my friend. I understand you uh, feel a certain way about Khajiit, but let me reassure you that you should not. Hooray! I just can't fill an order. Imperials, ugh. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours and ask Yorland Greymane for help? <laughs> I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric's stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it your way. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. Hmm. Battleborn. This war is a stupid and interesting. This war is as stupid as our feud with Clan Greyman. Yes, I could uh could agree with that. But there's one person that uh, showed up where they weren't wanted, and that is the Imperials. That must be uh, taken into account, surely. Shame on the Imperials for coming to Nordic lands and telling them how things will be. Hello. The future of Tamriel. And wow. There it is, friends. You're quite into that, aren't you? You have come. You have come to hear Talk the to me. of Talos. Sure. Hello, Can you tell friend. me about Talos? If you seek knowledge about mighty Talos. You have most certainly come to the right person. In mortal life, Talos was a Nord, possessed of unmatched tactical skill limitless wisdom and the power to see into men's hearts talos mastered mm. the power of the voice and with it he united the lands of men into a great empire in southern lands he was known by the name tiber septim here in skyrim we honor him by his proper nord name so great was his reign in life. When he ascended to the heavens, he was made Lord of the Divines. If you want to know more, I'm sure you can find any number of tomes on the subject. Yes, I know much about Talos, you know. God of man, god of war. I don't think that his name was Tiber Septum. Although I could be wrong on that as well, you know. Brandar is not so learned in the Nine Divines. Uh, I, I know very little, as a matter of fact. Their basic function is about all I know. But I've also heard here that uh, you're not supposed to be worshipping Talos. Can you tell me why it was outlawed? Is a coward. That's right, I said coward. Oh yes, he agreed to banish the worship of Talos at the tip of an Aldmeri sword. They called it the White Gold Concordant. Well, I call hmm. it blasphemy. A true son of the Empire would never have turned his back on our greatest hero. Not at any price. Well, let me tell you something, friend. Cyrodiil is a long way from here. And in Skyrim, we will never Forsake mighty Talos. 
And you're not worried that you'll be arrested out here? Uh, Do the town guards turn the other I way? No fear, for Talos is my ally, and I am his prophet. His word is upon my lips, his voice in my throat. Hmm. I find your uh, faith extremely empowering, friend, and I wish you luck. Very Thank you. Elven overlords. You see, it is quite a great shame that the Imperials and the Altmeria would come to Nordic lands and start to dictate. You can worship this god, you cannot worship this god. You must do this, you must do that. Although, I don't think that uh, Brandar would be so accepted if the Nords were in charge of things. Probably not even allowed into the city, to be quite honest. Ah, I'm still quite torn. But I'll tell you what breaks the tie. The fact that I was on a, an Imperial chopping block not even a week ago. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.